Today I'm going to show you how to install updates on your Apple iPhone. You may notice a little red number appear on your settings option, or you may just want to install updates to uh, keep up with them. The little red number indicates that there's a update already ready for your phone, but just because you don't have a number there uh, doesn't mean that there aren't any updates. So you check it very simply just by going into the settings options and then scrolling down until you see general and you select general and then there will be an option towards the top that says software updates. So you just click on that one and then it will tell you about any updates that are ready for your phone. In this case I have iOS 8.1 which is a larger update so it will take a while to install. Other updates might be a little smaller and go pretty quickly but you should make sure that you have a pretty good charge on your phone before installing any updates because if you your phone dies in the middle of them then bad things could happen. So make sure your phone is charged and then to install them you just hit the install button down towards the bottom. After you hit install it will ask you to agree to the terms and service. You just hit agree down at the bottom right and then it will go through the update process. Like I said, this will take a few minutes and once it's done, your phone will probably restart. So just let it sit there and when it comes, when you see, come back and see that it's at the home screen, then you know it's done and uh, then you'll be good to go. When you're back to this point, you know your update has finished being installed and you can go back into the settings again to the update manager to see if there are any updates still available. So if you go to the software update, then you can see here it'll search again and now it's saying that there are no updates. So if you see this screen, then you're good to go. Your phone is completely up to date. If you see anything else here, then you may have to install once or twice more to finish all the updates that it has because it won't necessarily be able to install everything at once. But after that, you're all finished and you're all up to date.